Hello guys, Zuljin here. Welcome back to another episode of Kingdom. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. Thank y'all so much for all the support on the Kingdom series. As always, if you guys do enjoy the videos, give me some dab on that like button to show you support for the series. And y'all can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. Still out doing my recruiting thing, guys. It's crucial that I get as many of these guys as possible. I do want to see what this is. This is archery upgrades. Fair enough. Do we need them right now? No. Do we have information that costed us five gold? Yes. <laughs> it's okay. I'm happy with knowing that information. It's really, really my number one goal to make sure that I know what's going on. Okay, we don't have any more. We could try to go a little bit further to see if there's that chest. But I don't think, no, there's the portal there. So that's not going to do us any good. So I don't have enough gold to uh, recruit these guys, but it should be fine. Uh, what we want to do today is possibly expand possibly expand uh people still gonna be the thing i need to get like four to six people a day if at all possible um and make sure that my gold flow is continuing to come in um the blood moons i don't think they're gonna be that tough yet but it's something to consider making sure my archers are buffed and um and i guess i can do that just right there so it'll be okay now, if my hunters can kill these deer, I can come back and recruit possibly this guy over the on the right here. You're going to turn around? Yeah, there you go. Go back. Go back. I'm sorry about that. My phone is right by my microphone, and it just vibrated. So I know that's quite loud next to the mic. Oh, I turned night before the guys got back. Lame. All right, well, at least you got a little bit of money for me. Uh, we do need to buy some bows for the recruits that we did get. My workers are still good for now, so we really don't have to worry about that. Let's see, did you guys get any cash? Not really. What's up? What's up with that? Um, we could start working towards the, the greater walls. Is that what we could get? But with this, with the buffed archers, this, this volley should not be anything. Now, it only lasts one night, though, so these extra accuracy arrows or whatever, they're not going to do anything for us, unfortunately. <laughs> but, like I said, I paid five gold for some information, and I think it was worth it. So, now that we're finished with that, we can probably go out and get the recruits that I was looking for earlier. Perfect. This is day 10. Okay. Blood Moon tonight. Very, very, very important. So I don't think I can gear up to attack the portal fast enough after it dies. And I don't know which side they're going to be coming from. I wish I knew what portals went down after the Blood Moon. You know, like, because the portal goes down after the Blood Moon for sure. I do have enough to pay for an archery buff again if I wanted to go out there, but... Actually, you know what? Let's go do that. Let's go do that. I think it's important. I do have a couple bows stocked. We should be alright. As soon as I get out there, I'll pay for the buff, and it'll just help me survive the Blood Moon for sure. Or minimize the casualties. I'm not worried about survival uh, that much. Okay. There we go. Now, we have a little bit of leeway here. It should be good. So, I also, I thought the buffs had to do with the amount of buff that they get, but really it's the time that they get buffed. So, I think that counts for two or three days right there. I don't know. I think so. All right. Give me all that gold that you just dropped, buddy. I'm going to need that. Okay. Is there any villagers here? No, I guess not. Oh, wait. Yeah, there's one. There you go. Take my money, please. Okay, this helps a lot. And we should probably... You know, let's do this. Let's give one more wall. Or one more level of depth to the wall oh no wait this isn't my far one this is my far one no 
Now, if I really wanted to do knights here to the right, I would probably need to save that because I would need to go for a castle and knights and people. Really, I would need to start preparing for that on like day eight, I think. I think it's really too soon to go after the portals. I think it is. There's the good wall. All right. Best thing I could do here, I think, is um, is make sure I have bows and hands. I could possibly minimize the damage on the outside by dropping some gold. But honestly, with the amount of orchards I have right now, I don't think it's necessary. If the builders had to come out, I think it would be. But let's hope that this wall, or the lack of this wall, uh, will be okay. Of course, they all need to get on this side of it. Now, even if we get some flyers and some giants, I have confidence that we'll be able to minimize the casualties here. You still farting around on that side of the wall? Get in the house! Alright. Not seeing a whole bunch on this side happen. Oh, apparently it came on this side already. Yeah, shoot him. All right. Well, that wasn't that bad. It happened on that side. And it looks like I lost a few people, but nothing major. Okay. So now I can refill my supplies. I guess there, my archers were a little bit too far out there or something. Okay, so we have no problems today. So I can buy, can buy some, some bows. Okay. Now everybody should be pretty much full, full. Okay. You guys need to go hunt. I seriously need some, um, some TLC on the hunting front today. <laughs> like bad. It's probably time I'll move out to getting farms done now. Um, at least one side and we can have up to four farmers with that one side and I do have a few people set up for it so that'll increase my cash flow a ton I think it's an investment in the long run so sooner or later I should have enough or I could just keep on recruiting too we'll see how the gold flow goes right now it's getting kind of hard for me to keep up with the demand for bows I got two people that need bows here. So you see, they don't go too far out. They don't get a whole lot of money when they're out either. So yeah, I think... I think getting farming set up will be better. So let's do that, shall we? Let's plant some seeds. Um... First thing we got to do is get the farm ready. And I do need to expand past that too. Where is the little mound? See, that's hard. That means I have to bring my people all the way out here to get that farming done. I might just have to stay with hunters for a little while. But the gold flow is a little bit... Um, I don't know. I'm thinking that the gold flow is a little bit too restricted right here. Because as you see, I didn't I didn't make much money, and that's probably gonna be my downfall. That's why I always resort to the farming. But I can't expand past here. I can't. This village is like it's just too good having a village here. What I can do is put my wall here, but again, I, I really don't need to. If I'm going to expand anywhere, it needs to be to the left. So there's four gold. Nothing's going to be attacking tonight, so I don't need to worry about that. Chasing some deer would probably be beneficial. How much do I have right now? I need two more to be able to build that farm. And 
Might as well buy bows just to make sure. Still have six workers. That's plenty enough. And as soon as the night passes, I should be alright here. Let's see here. We're past the mid part of night. Otherwise known as midnight. I don't know why I said it like that. <laughs> and I have to queue these for destruction so I can expand that way. We got to put a wall in front. So that's what we'll do. Come on, taxes. Takes a little while sometimes. How'd you get a dollar? Well, I'll get the workers moving in that direction. Here we go. So the workers are ahead now. And now, now that the workers are heading out there, if I do get my tax money, I could go out there and queue them for the rest. So you guys need to go hunt. For real. I know it's still early, still drinking your coffee, chilling, having a good old time. Sun's up, man. Where's the tax money? Pay up, suckers. I need them ends for the kingdom. Man, I feel like I'm wasting so much time right now. There it is. Okay. Yeah, this cash flow is bothering me, guys. Big time. Huge bother. As soon as that goes away, I should be able to build a wall there. And then once I get that done, we can start putting money into the farming. And hopefully these guys hunt more rabbits like this. I don't know, this tree's almost gone. As soon as that tree's gone, I should be able to build right here. Maybe. Come on, update, man. Here we go. Finally! It's gonna be fast. Look at the arches I have. It's amazing. People, 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 man. That's the name of the game. I even have room for more, too. Okay. I need to go to the right right quick to recruit. Since I'm already on this side, it's not gonna take up too much time. There's two people I can get. There we go. And I need to quickly go to the left and make sure that wall is more... More sturdy, I guess you could say. Hardcore. I need a hardcore wall. Alright. Uh, hopefully I have builders somewhere in this vicinity. Look at the archers I have, man. Again, with um, with one layer of wood wall, I still should be fine with this amount of archers. Might be a little while before the catapult comes up. Hurry, man. <laughs> Hurry. I didn't know it was going to be dark so fast. Yeah, you guys triple team it. Okay, come back on this side. Wait, archers, come back over here. What are y'all doing? Ah. This is a mess. Oh, they went they went get the uh they went get the siege engine. Oh man, my rock took out half the uh my own people. I don't think I lost anything though. Not to talk about. These two guys. And some hammers, maybe. I should be alright though. Alright. 
And it's not like I meant to before y'all even say. I just didn't think it was that late. Were y'all shooting already? What are y'all shooting at? Rabbits, I guess, huh? Uh-huh. Yeah, that's what it has to be. One more. Okay. Yeah, we need to make sure that wall is up to par. If I wouldn't have had to go to the right there, uh, it would have been a little bit easier, I suppose. Let's see. We do have people without jobs right now, but it's not a big, big deal. I need to, I need to see who's unemployed, who's building, who's archers, and all that stuff before I purchase any more tools. See, there's one builder over here already coming out to fix. And there's already one builder out here, so that's two. So anything in addition to that is what we'd be looking at. This will be enough for one hammer if I need it. So that's two builders. There's four builders. We could afford like two more hammers. I had six earlier, so I guess that would be what we lost, essentially. Alright, can we hire anybody else? We can. I've been slowing down on my recruiting too, which is not good. I need to start doing that again. It's getting progressively harder. I gotta keep swelling the ranks. And I know the merchant's there and he can offer cheaper tools, but I get him scared. It might be scythes or something, which honestly, Unless it's workers, I think I'd be all okay. I would I would probably go for either or. I might take the chance. We'll see what it is. Yeah, I think I will. How much gold do I have? Three. Let me get one more gold. And I think it would be worth it to hire that uh, that merchant. I do want to bring this up one more level too, before the blood moon. Y'all get anything? No. You're killing me, man. Killing me. I guess y'all are gonna come in. I don't know where all the rabbits at, but to upgrade this wall, it would take nine. Huh. <sighs> I don't know if I'm ready for to invest six until I can properly protect it. I don't know. I need a few more dollars to make it happen, basically. That merchant's going to be a good call if I can get to it quickly. He may or may not make it. <laughs> I do have four gold to be able to hire the merchant as soon as the the clock strikes. But first I have to defend myself through the night. And he didn't make it. Man, the arrows are real, huh? I think that's it. That was the one gold they took. <laughs> they knocked that guy out. All right. Fair enough. Um, how are you guys doing over here? You all survived the night? No problems? No? Pretty good. Okay. Fine. So, merchant. And then... We'll see where we at. We'll see what he brings us. Yeah, kill some rabbits, please. I guess I could bring back some deer to kind of accelerate the process. Let's see where the merchant's at. He was right here last night. Ah, uh, there he is. Okay. Now let's get in front of these deer and bring them back. I think it's going to be worth that call. Still need to get back to that wall on the west side to make sure that it's uh it's all the way up. Okay, that's as far as I can go with uh with the deer. I don't want to waste too much time. Eat grass, horse, please. Nope. 
Not gonna happen. You only eat grass where you want to. I'm gonna eat exactly where the deer was eating. Maybe it's because the grass smelled good right there? No. You're just a stubborn horse. That's all there is to it. Alright. Archer volley coming in. Anytime now. Come, turn back around. Turn around, I need your money. Dang it. Hmm. I don't think I can make it, but it's a couple extra bucks. I'll take it. Okay, so what is this guy going to give me? If he, if he gives me farming equipment, that'll be pretty good. I'll consider that a win. He did not. He also did not give me bows. He's going to give me the very thing I do not want. Ah. Dang it, man. Well... <laughs> I mean, what can I say, guys? What can I say? Um, let's get it ready for tomorrow. We're behind the walls and we'll have extra workers, so... Might as well. Sheesh, man, that hurts. That really hurts. Two out of three, we would have won. And he picked the one that we didn't win on. Freaking hammers. Also... No, I'm not going to worry about these walls yet. Because tomorrow, if I do have to wait, farming is going to be what I go for. This wall has to get upgraded before the Blood Moon, too. That's going to be the big one. Uh, in fact, I should have enough after this. I should have enough to just straight up upgrade it while I'm on this side. And it'll save me for tomorrow night. That's what I'm hoping for, anyway. Alright, I should have time now. Let's do it. Here we go. Alright, guys. You'll be good. I'm going back to the other side. Apparently we lost somebody. Lost a couple people, maybe. Let's rehire, shall we? I guess that's all. Um, so this is the night of the Blood Moon. The, f the fortifications are good on the left side. The amount of arches that we have should be maximized. And we should probably buff our archers just in case. Wouldn't you agree? We'll go out and spend that five gold. Making sure our... Our swords are sharp, so to speak. If I have any extra cash, I'll recruit on the way back. I'd love to get these guys, but I'm not sure if they'll make it. There we go. Uh, that ought to be good for... I might as well do two. I think it's two nights, but you know what I mean. Just in case, guys. <laughs> it, it was It's probably overspending is what I just did, but... Better be safe than sorry. I would love to spend five gold to minimize the casualties if I can. Because I'm much less like I'm much more likely to lose more gold. As, as soon as I start to think that I understand the game concepts, <laughs> it proves me wrong. Like, it slaps me straight up. All right. Some money would be cool. I uh, still need a little bit more money. The wall's as high as it can go right here, right? No cash? None of y'all? That's rough. We do have a lot of archers, though. 
and the wall's as high as it can go. So I guess I'm satisfied with that. So the Blood Moon's coming. Now, I said that I wanted to attack tomorrow. <laughs> I guess I should probably make that attempt. The retaliation is going to be awful, though. I don't think I'm in a financial situation. I think I need to wait until day 21 to do it. Which, that'll be our goal, is to get there. As long as he has that many people to defend him, I think it'll be fine, huh? I wish I had one... Oh, a few more gold, actually. You know what? I'll hire you too, even though you're useless. <laughs> we'll get you in the camp. I think I'll survive this blood moon. Maybe one extra body for the flyers to pick off. Alright, there it is. You know, I think it's going to come from the right, so I'm going to predict that it comes from the right. And hang around this side. I just need to stay in fr away from this catapult. <laughs> Y'all know how the catapults do me. Why are you standing out there, dude? I guess he's waiting at the uh, the scythe shop. It's like, hey, can I can I can I be a potato farmer? Um. I hope the blood moon is not happening on this side. Uh-oh. People coming in. Okay, the wall is damaged, but all is not lost. Looks like a couple people, maybe. Still a lot of archers. Okay, so... I don't know exactly what happened just then. I wish I was on the left side to see. If you guys know of any way to determine which side the Blood Moon is going to be coming, like, which side the Horde's going to be coming from, y'all let me know. I need bows. Like, that's the majority of what I need right now. It's just weapons. Uh, there will be no attack tonight. So it will give me the opportunity to hire somebody for a scythe. I think I'm going to do that. Start this process off. And it should be good. As long as I get a little bit more cash flow, recruiting can come a little easier. And I know some of you are like, why are you recruiting when you have no, hand, no weapons to fill? Well, the thing about it is, is they stay behind my walls. And as soon as I do get whip, as soon as I do get cash, it's on. So, yeah, I have a few more available. I wish there was a way to know what that merchant was going to do. I need to upgrade that to tier 2 as well. So I think my next 15 or 20 gold need to be devoted to that, that farm project. And I wish they would hunt, man. What is wrong with you guys? Why don't y'all hunt? Kill something. Last few times I came over here, y'all don't have any money. And these are people that are lost, apparently. Hmm. Alright. Let's get back to business. Hopefully we'll get some money somewhere in something. Yeah, he'll be able to do a little bit of... A little bit of gold gathering there in his field. Hopefully we have enough to gather a couple more sides. That would be nice. That's almost enough. Very, very close. If you guys have any, let me know now. Nope. Did somebody shoot a rabbit over here? Yep. All right, we'll make it happen with a scythe. Okay, that looks good. We got two. So the situation, the cast situation is going to get much better rapidly. At least I hope so. 
And because it's a calm night and we're at about 30 minutes, I'm going to go ahead and cut the video here, you guys. I hope you all enjoyed this episode of Kingdom. As always, if you do enjoy the video, make sure to give me some dap on that like button to show you support for the series. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos, guys. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Uljin signing off, and we'll see you next time.